Today, we're gonna be going through the simple six step cold email template we used to book over 3,270 sales calls in 14 months while printing millions of dollars in revenue. So if you run a B2B growth marketing agency, a lead generation agency, or for B2B business owners who run some kind of a B2B business, knowing this cold email template and knowing how to use it is literally going to change your business. So do not miss it out. So for example, here on figure one, we have Omar booking a meeting with Nokia, which is a 20 two billion dollar company with cold email figure two is luis lagunas booking four discovery calls in two days with fifteen hundred thousand dollars a month agencies so really high quality prospects four calls in two days figure number three yona booking 10 calls and 20 opportunities in four days figure number four marinum booking four calls in a day figure number five kai booking 10 meetings in three days which is pretty crazy figure number six theodore booking seven calls in a week for e-com offer during the summer so if you know any anything about doing cold email for the e-com industry it's pretty hard and if you know anything about doing cold email during the summer when everyone's on their vacation it's also pretty hard and he still managed to book seven calls in a week during the summer jeremy dixon booking four meetings in a day gilberto booking six discord calls for one day through cold email so once again a pretty nice day kai booking 97 meetings in 90 days for his client so during q1 booked almost 100 calls which is pretty crazy and i know a lot of these calls with were like huge companies with like huge in industry titans like Binance, etc. Almost 100 calls in 90 days. Daniel booking 100 calls in a month with cold email using the structure and this template. Horia booking four calls in a day. Rene booking three calls in a day for a UI slash UX offers. White booking eight calls in a day. Rush getting 28 hot leads in a day. Five booked calls for an expo client. Oliver booking a call with Heineken, which has over 50 bill valuation. And Haribo, which has over 2 billion euros valuation. Imagine if you're able to get in front of these companies and actually sell these companies to sending simple cold emails. So that's why this template works so well and that's why the template is so powerful. Figure 16, Miles booking four discovery calls in a day. Figure 17, Raj again booking six meetings in a day, two days in a row, so six and six. Haig booking three meetings in one hour for one of his clients, which is pretty sick. Jack closing over a quarter of a million dollars in insurance premium in one and a half months through cold email. So once again, just selling some insurance premium, making like 250k, which is pretty crazy. Rene with UI UX again, booking 14 meetings in a week. Sondre booking eight calls in a day and 16 over three days. Kai booking seven meetings in one morning during summer. Arash booking 13 interest replies, plus three booked calls and five demos in a day with cold email. Emil and Elliot launching campaigns and booking five calls immediately after a few hours of launching. Larry booking seven calls in a week. Theodore getting 17 interest replies in a few days in e com after launching new campaigns. Luke helping his clients close $42,000 in new revenue in 30 days through cold email. Daniel booking 19 calls in eight days for a branding offer. If you ever done cold email for a branding offer, it's a bit difficult. So Daniel booking 19 calls in eight days for it is pretty sick. Raj booking 63 interested replies and 27 calls in a month. And also I just want to throw in figure number 30. This is the exact same template that I used to get my first case study where we leveraged cold email on LinkedIn. Pretty much this exact same template to make over 100,000 euros in a few months for my client and then for another client we booked over 53 qualified discovery calls through cold email during the first month we worked together so that was also a sick case study that really helped me change my life i went from being extremely poor to now living my dream life it has done the same for a lot of our clients we have guys who have made over 30 40 50 70 thousand dollars in one single month using this template if you know how to use cold email and if you know how to use this template you have the keys to the castle who is this presentation going to be for first of all it's going to be for you if you are running a b2b lead transition agency Agency, and you're looking to get Elvis has left the building results for your clients. So absolutely amazing results. Or if you run a social media marketing agency, a web design agency, AIAA agency, or any other B2B marketing agency, and you're looking to get the OK send invoice clients. Everyone knows those OK send invoice clients. If you don't know, then you really need this. But you're just looking to get like really high quality, really high paying clients that are easy to work with. Then this is going to be for you. If you run any B2B high ticket service slash product based business, then this is for you. If you have already tried to use cold email to grow your business but the results were more depressing than sitting in a middle seat for 16 hour plane ride then this is going to be for you if you're frustrated with an empty calendar and probably an empty bank account as well and you're looking for a predictable way to book high quality calls with qualified prospects on daily basis then this is for you if you're looking to grow your business to seven figure yearly run rate through the most predictable and efficient client acquisition channel while fulfilling your dreams and living your dream life then this is for you and last but not least if you want to have your friends shout wow what the fuck do you do for work 
work when seeing the view out of your living room, then this is gonna be for you. If you wanna live in a nice penthouse. And also, this is not gonna be for people who think cold email is just copy pasting a cold email template from a dude with a funny accent on YouTube. And this is also not gonna be for people who wanna take an easy shortcut to success. The truth about blaming the template and the real reasons your cold emails are not printing cash. Many entrepreneurs labor under the illusion that the success of their cold emails boils down to the perfect template, the perfect line, or the magic subject that gets people clicking. They often think and say things like, oh, my cold email game isn't working because I haven't found the one secret trick that everyone else is using, blah, 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 blah. But let me give you a quick reality check. That mindset is fucking delusional. The truth is your cold email can be a masterpiece of copywriting, but if your overall offer is a lifeless mess, if your landing page is a digital eyesore, or if your targeting is off, your results will suck. And not just suck, they will be abysmal. So if you remember the concept of cognitive dissonance from psychology, when your emails promise the world, but your landing page is mediocre, it's just a digital eyesore, you'll create a psychological disconnect for the prospect. They may not know why, but they'll start doubting your credibility and no amount of persuasive copy can salvage that. Because cold email is not an isolated technique. A lot of people think it is, but it's not an isolated technique. It's a component of your entire value proposition. It is an application of systems theory in marketing. It is part of a bigger ecosystem that actually makes it work. Each element, like your market understanding, your offer, your landing page, and your positioning functions as a part of an interconnected system. The real potency comes when these elements are perfectly aligned. So why does this matter? Because when you get this right, your ROI isn't just going to see a small bump and you won't be scratching your head over a 20 or 30% increase. You'll be looking at three or five or even 10 explosion in your results. Because a lot of the times, all of these parts are completely messed out and nothing might be happening and you're like starting to fix all of these small pieces. And then when suddenly everything is aligned perfectly in the system, you can go from pretty much doing nothing to suddenly like the whole company exploding and you're doing like 30K a month. It is really important. So I want you to to let that sink in. You'll pretty much go from being another internet marketer, posting cringy life updates on LinkedIn to a maestro who understands the symphony of factors that makes cold email strategy effective. Cold email, when done right, is a huge lever for your business. It's the closest thing to alchemy that exists in digital marketing, but instead of turning base metals into gold, you're turning cold prospects into hot leads. The psychology of cold email is more nuanced than most understand. You're capitalizing on the reciprocity principle. Give your prospect something of real value and they'll feel psychologically compelled to give back. When you do that right, it's not just an email, it's a magnetic force pulling your prospects into the world. So in this presentation, I will show you the exact template we use to get the highest possible outcome from the business at its current state. Plus, I will also reveal you three quick tweaks you can make two to five extra results without even touching the cold email campaigns at all. And when executed correctly, this has the potential to completely change your business and life. So do not miss this. If you have never heard of me, a quick background, my name is Levi. Erla. I'm a second lieutenant of the Finnish Defense Forces, and I also scaled from zero to $45,000 a month through a B2B lead generation agency in six months, going from completely broke to actually living a pretty great life, traveling the world, doing all the cool things that I always wanted to do through B2B lead gen and using this exact same template. So let's get into the sauce you are here for. The 3000 call template goes like this. Hi, first name, location-based personalization. I wanted to reach out to you since we have been helping niche companies in location to achieve end result in this time frame without a common pain point. Guarantee. Do you mind if I send a bit more information about this signature and a PS line with a case study? Right now you're probably thinking, what the fuck is this lab? Is this the mega template behind all the results? I were expecting all of these crazy cool things and I were expecting this like one shortcut that would change my whole life. And yes, my answer is yes, this is the template. But give me a few minutes to explain the template to you and how to use it so you'll see why it works so well. The first line, this section of the template is fairly self-explanatory. Our goal is simple. We want to greet the prospect with their first name and show that we have done our research on them. If the person thinks we have sent this email to them personally, they'll be more likely to respond to it since we have taken time out of our day to research their location and specifically send an email to them. And once again, this goes back to the reciprocity principle. So we have taken time out of our day and put in energy to send them the email so they feel psychologically that they owe us a reply. Obviously, we don't want to send these emails by hand. So the trick is to target one location at a time. For example, we can run a campaign to only prospects located in 
France and started the campaign off by saying, I'll make this email short, unlike the line at the Louvre Ray. Haha. <laughs> so this way, the prospect immediately sees that it has specifically been sent to them. And also an easy way to get extra points in the mind of the prospect is to make it funny. You won't always make it funny. You might try and it just ends up being super cringy and cheesy, but in my opinion, it's worth the risk. When I'm writing this first line, what I just do is I just Google funny facts about location. If I want to write it about France, I'll just write funny facts about France and I'll just go through the articles. Make sure your first line is in something super offensive or stereotypical. It'll do more harm than good. So if I sent this email talking about baguettes and croissants, I don't know if it would resonate. Maybe French people, they're proud of it, but you always want to stay out of like the super stereotypical and offensive lines. Then we go to the email body. The email body pretty much is the section where you say, I want to reach out to you since we have been helping niche companies in location to achieve any result in this time frame without a common pain point. After the first line, we want to go straight to the point. When sending cold emails, you're fighting for the attention of the prospect. The chances are that they have over 100 emails, they have their co-workers hitting them up on Slack, and their wife is calling them about the broken doorknob that needs fixing so little Timmy doesn't escape the house. Because of this, we need to immediately hit them with the relevant information, and we need to answer what do we do, who we do it for, what can they gain, and how fast. They don't really care about your background story and your values, etc. They just care what can I get from this and how fast will I get it. I need it to be simple and easy to understand. Also, a great bonus is if you can mention a painful thing they can stop doing when working with you to increase the perceived value of your solution. As you can see, the email can be extremely simple if you understand the end result your niche is looking for and if you can also provide it and you know what painful things they commonly struggle with. The key to making the email body resonate with your prospect is to listen for the common pain points in the market. And you can find these common pain points from forums your prospects hang out in, so Reddit or something like that, communities revolving around your niche, the LinkedIn content your prospects write, and also the best source is to just listen to your prospects in sales calls and emails, because they will literally tell exactly what they want, and what things they hate during the call. It is also important that you have your ears open for the end results your prospects desire. Some niches on average want more revenue, other niches care about their market share, other niches care about clients and profit and etc. There's different metrics that they care about. So it is extremely important that you position your offer towards this exact end result. If you have the thesis or case studies to prove your results, you can also make super bold claims. I truly recommend you to read through Breakthrough Advertising by Eugene M. Swartz, because in this book, he breaks down how markets mature, how to communicate offers to them and what kind of awareness levels there are in different markets. Because if the market is super mature and they have already seen a bunch of different claims, you'll need to use a little bit of different messaging to communicate your offer to them. So when you understand this, you will be able to write banger body copy for your emails. So if you want to take like the biggest, biggest, biggest juice out of this cold email template and squeeze out the maximum results, I would 100% recommend that you read through this. Then we go into the guarantee. After we have promised the world to our prospects, they will be thinking in their head, damn, what a snake oil salesman probably won't even deliver results. So here we want to reverse the risk and offer them a guarantee. When done right, this will drop the walls of the prospect and spark their excitement about your email. And when delivering a done for you service, your advantage is that you are in almost full control of the results you generate. And because of this, you can offer really, really bold guarantees. If you don't have a guarantee, leave the spot empty or just get better so you can offer a good guarantee. Like if you're delivering a done for you service, there's almost zero reasons why you wouldn't have a guarantee. Sometimes, yeah, if you are like in a fractional consultant position or like fractional CMO position, then it might make sense, but that's not really done for you. But if you're delivering a result, your customers and you are in charge of the results you generate, have a really good guarantee. And if you can't have a good guarantee, just get better. We're gonna just literally like five extra results if you just get a bit better. And a great example of a guarantee would be, we guarantee that you will get a 3x return on your investment in the first 97 days, or we'll fully refund you and pay for a private tour at the Louvre for you and your whole sales team. If you send this to people in France, like we are able to really also play into the fact that they're from France. It's like a funny thing specifically for them. And you can also like joke about it. Like, yeah, like the lines are so long, so we'll just give you a private tour. This way the prospect sees that there is no way they will lose money on this. Plus they actually have an opportunity to gain something valuable if everything goes south. Like a private tour to Louvre isn't super cheap. And then we go to the call to action. So pretty much do you mind if I send a bit more information about it? There are multiple ways to do call to actions on cold emails. You can do hard CTAs that directly ask them for a call. So like, yo, John, do you have a time for a 30 minute call next Thursday? Or you can offer them a quick video or a resource that provides them value about the topic. There's no right or wrong way to do this, but for the maximum performance, I recommend using the CTA mentioned in the template or something else that is like equally as so. This CTA gives you a lot of optionalities on how you want to continue with the conversation. And it is also really low friction and easy to reply to. They are not really committing into anything. They're just like committing into getting more information. And also it's a yes or no question.
question. You wanna think about it, like if you're prospect in a grocery store line and they're like waiting for their turn and they see your email and they're there on their phone, they need to be able to reply to your email on their phone in five seconds. Otherwise they won't reply. Experiment with your CTA when everything else is optimized and test it in the campaign. So testing the CTA won't really have a big, big, big difference. It's better to focus on the body copy and the guarantee. Those are gonna move the needle more like this. And then this, when everything else is really rolling really well and you're sure that, okay, my body copy, my guarantee, my targeting is really solid, then you're gonna also play around with the CTA to see if you can squeeze any extra results with a different call to action. Then for your signature, super self-explanatory, just tell who you are, don't add any links to ensure the perfect deliverability. Just do name, company name and title, address and phone number. And the reason why you wanna add address and phone number is just makes you more credible. So just add them for the small improvement in results. The PS sections are pretty much like the last thing that they see on the email. So we just pretty much do PS case study. And here on this PS section of the email, we wanna drop some extra credibility. If you're just starting out and you don't have a case study, you can just leave the section blank. And if you have a case study, position it to reflect the most desired end result your niche is looking for and present it in a single line. So for example, PS, last month we helped company X go from an empty calendar to booking over 25 qualified sales meetings in a month with Fortune 500 prospects while helping them to increase their closing rate by 50%. This way you will showcase that you know what you're talking about and it's like the last nail in the coffin. Like they're like, they see the first line, damn, that's nice. The body copy, damn, that sounds really interesting. A guarantee, a low friction call to action, your signature, and you end the email with a really nice case study and they're like a perfect email. But yeah, so by just using that template, I guarantee you will increase your cold email results a lot. But like I mentioned before, cold email is not an isolated technique. It is a component of your entire value proposition. So by fixing some basic things in your foundations, you will be able to grab your market on a chokehold and uh, dominate the game even harder. What are these three tweaks that I promise to tell you? First tweak is to fix your funnel. Super simple. This one is way more important than you would even think. If you remember how I mentioned the concept of cognitive dissonance, this is playing directly into it. Even if your cold emails are absolute bangers, your prospects will check your landing page nine out of 10 times before hopping on a call with you. And if after Googling your domain, they land on a landing page that looks like a 15 year old kid's school project, they will immediately find themselves asking, is this a fucking joke? If you just take a day out of your week to clean up your funnel, you will immediately increase the results of your cold email campaigns by a lot. You can literally two to three extra results by just having a better funnel and a better VSL. And no, you don't need a $10,000 website built by a team of ice coffee drinking design enthusiasts. Just make sure your design is clean, the color scheme is nice, and you don't have anything useless on your landing page. A great structure to follow on your landing page is just have a benefit focused headline, a video sales letter breaking down your sales argument, and a call to action to learn more by booking a call. Because the less variables you have, it is to get it right. So what you just do is you just open up card.co or ClickFunnels. Those are like really great website builders and spend a day tweaking around the settings to make it look nice. Buy a cheap $50 microphone and a ring light, you know, the TikTok ring lights and use your iPhone as a webcam to record a video sales letter. Wear a nice shirt, get a clean haircut and go through what you do for a niche, what results you have gotten, who you are, how your service works and how they can learn more about it. And doing this will already place you above 90% of the companies with confusing websites filled with ChatGPT inspired buzzwords. I guarantee you, if you just have this landing page and you just make it look nice, you will literally two to three X your cold email results without changing anything. I guarantee you, it is so important. Tweak two, clean up your social presence. Once again, super easy. It's gonna take you like an hour or two because your landing page won't be the only thing your prospects will be checking out and trying to learn more about you. In a lot of cases, they will also Google your name or at least check you out on LinkedIn. You wanna make sure that your first impression on these channels is as positive as possible. What you do is you get rid of your college drinking photos and all of the dumb shit that you can find when you Google your name and you optimize your LinkedIn profile to look nice, provide valuable information about you. And make sure there's nothing crazy popping up when someone Googles your name. And just have a nice profile picture, a nice headline on LinkedIn, have a banner photo, all of the basic stuff. Go on LinkedIn, look at the biggest creators and see how their profile is set up and just copy them. Last tweak, which is also super, super important is creating nurturing marketing assets. This will take a bit more time than the first two tweaks, but it's also going to provide a huge leverage for your business. And easy way to nurture cold prospects into people looking to buy from you is creating valuable and unique marketing assets that you can distribute on your social media and landing page and also cold emails. So what you do is you create training documents and videos that your prospects find valuable and you can use to learn more about your process. Go to LinkedIn, create valuable social media posts, breaking down like lead generation for your niche and go to YouTube and talk about these topics and create different training docs and create case study docs and just do tutorials on how to set up cold email domains. So just pretty much make it as easy as possible for a prospect to consume your content and they will naturally see that you have a lot of valuable insights, take a benefit from.
from. And also naturally when they watch through your content, they will get warmer and warmer and warmer buying from you. On average, it takes seven hours to convert someone from completely cold prospect to happy paying customer. So if you're just able to like have them consume your stuff, think about your stuff, go to your videos, go to your docs, go to your posts, they will naturally just get more nurtured. And then when you hop on a call with them, it's going to be way easier to close. Them. Also, the great thing about these marketing assets is that they are evergreen. You can spend a few days writing a document and you can use it for years as long as it stays relevant to the market. So as you can see, if you just use the template I just provided in your cold email campaigns, fix your funnel, clean your social media presence and create nurturing marketing assets, you will be able to fill your calendar up with hot leads throughout a predictable cold email process and literally change your life. And also a quick side note, if you're looking to leverage cold email to build a profitable B2B lead transition agency and scale that to $10,000 a month in 90 days while providing amazing results to your clients, you can also go check out agencyvelocity.io and you can book a call with me or my team to see if you are a fit. Pretty much agencyvelocity.io is our consulting company where we help people build lead transition agencies throughout things like this. We help you optimize everything. We help you with your code emails. We help you with your niche and offer and VSLs. Pretty much help you everything on one-on-one -on -one to make sure that you succeed. We have in-person events. So if you just want to pretty much build a really solid B2B growth marketing agency, do lead gen for companies. Also check out Agents of Velocity. I hope you truly enjoyed. Put this code email template to use. Let me know in the comments how you enjoyed it. Drop me a like. Take care.